What's going on guys, it's Vigilante here and you're watching the Vigilante Effect and today is Tutorial Tuesday as promised every Tuesday or every other Tuesday is going to be some sort of tutorial and today's tutorial is sometimes a common problem um, one problem that I had to deal with which is um, basically having your CD drive not show up on your desktop um, or in my computer so any CD you would put into your CD drive it's not going to play because um, for some reason the system is not reading it and uh, this this usually sometimes happens with um, Windows 7 um, so I'm going to talk about the Windows 7 fix for this so here's what you do you go to um, start and in the search you will type reg edit oh, sorry all right, and then you go on that, click yes. Now that we're here, let me just clear everything up, start all the way from the beginning. Um, okay. All right. So now that we're here, here's where we're going to go to. We are going to go to H key local machine. All right, so we open that up. And from there, we're going to go to system. And from system, we're going to go to current control set, then control. Now at control, we're going to go to class. And I'm going to put the link below, um, basically the, uh, uh, the address below, the address that you would have to go to um, in terms of the window so that you know the number exactly. But the number is, is the number that we need to get to is 4D36E965. So let's find that right here. We're gonna open that up. Mm, I'll open it up. All right, okay. So here I already fixed my problem. I had this problem. So here what you would see is something called um, you have lower filters and you have upper filters. Um, what we're going to need to delete is the upper filters and the lower filters. Now there's also something called upper filters dot back, um, which is upper filters dot B A K. That one, you should leave that alone. Um, but the one that we need to delete is upper filters. So as you can see, I already have it deleted, but to delete lower filters, you would go right click and then simply delete. Certain so registry values could cause system instability. Are you sure you want to permanently delete this value? Yes. So now we deleted the lower filter and also um, when you guys have the upper filter, you delete that as well. Now, you now that you deleted it, you just close it, everything, and uh, you restart the computer and you will be set and that's it. And hopefully you will be able to see um, you'll be able to see your CD or DVD drive, whatever it may be. And it should show up normally and fine. I actually had to deal with this problem for a long time. I didn't think there was a fix for it. Um, I just basically let it go on the back burner because I wasn't looking to use the drive. But after f searching for uh, the solution for this, I finally found it. And uh, I hope it works for you. If it doesn't work, just let me know in the comment section below. Maybe I can still help. This has been the Vigilante Effect. Peace. Thumbs up and subscribe, people.